Hey guys and welcome back to another Technology Guru video. So in today's tutorial, I'm going to be showing you guys how to upload video to Facebook on both the desktop and mobile version. So we're going to start with the desktop version first. So in order to do that, go to where you would normally write your status or update your status and then click on the photo slash video option, which will be the middle one there. And then you're going to see four different options. Now, don't worry about the photo carousel or slideshow. Now those are videos and can be, but the one we want is to upload an actual video. So click the upload photos and videos and then locate the video that you are wanting to upload to Facebook on your desktop and then click on that video, either double click the video or click the blue open button there. So I'm going to double click the video and then you're going to see the upload video template come available to you. You can do multiple things once you are here. You can say something about that video so you can update your status and say this is the coolest video ever. So you can type in whatever you want to type in your status there and then you can even add a title for the video right here under video title and then under video tags you can basically type in keywords that are related to this specific video like you would in YouTube or any other video upload. Now with the captions option here you can upload captions for the video and then under advanced you don't really need to mess with anything here unless you want to exclude the video from your newsfeed or maybe even make it available to certain people. So go back to the basic tab here and one thing that Facebook recently did is they allowed you to upload custom thumbnails. You can click on the add custom thumbnail here and then select a thumbnail that you've created in Photoshop or wherever to use as the thumbnail for your video. And then as with any status update within Facebook, you can add and tag people and, and locate where you are. And then down here in the lower right hand corner, you're going to see the publish button. You can either click the blue publish button right off or click the down arrow beside the publish button and you're going to see something that says schedule post backdate or save as unpublished. Now scheduling the post will allow you to schedule the post for a later date if you want to schedule the video to go out later on in the week or month or whenever you want to distribute the video and then you can even go down here and backdate the video. The only reason you would really want to do that is if you're creating an ad so I'm not going to talk about that now. So we can click the blue publish button there and then you're going to see a blue progress bar that says preparing the video. Once it is done, it will let you know you'll have a notification and you'll even receive an email and then you can go to your video library and find it there. So that's how you do it on the desktop. Let's go to mobile and let me show you how to do it there. Here we are now within the Facebook mobile application and in order to upload a video on mobile, basically you go to the photo tab. So you tap the photo option in the center of the screen there, right by status, and then scroll your photos on your phone. I have a really cute one of my daughter here somewhere. There she is. And then we select the video and then tap done in the upper right hand corner. And then once the video is about to be published, we can say something about the video. So type in a whole bunch of stuff there at the top. And then we can even add more about the post by checking in somewhere, telling people how we're feeling, tagging people in the post. And then once we've done that, we can even click on the video once again and then click the magic wand or the edit button. And we can even go here and trim the video. We can crop it. We can adjust the sound as far as whether the sound is on or off and do a number of things. And then once we're done, tap the done option in the upper right hand corner of the screen. And then once we're finished editing and creating the video that we want to post, we will then tap the post button in the upper right hand corner. And you, my friends, have now posted a video on Facebook through the mobile app. I hope this video was helpful. If it was, go ahead and like the video, share it with your friends and or family. And as always, guys, thank you so much for watching my videos and I will see you guys in the next one.